It's your boy EB. You're watching EB Family ENT. And if you like what you see, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. So you could become part of EB Family. Dust to dust. The warning. Live at Lenario CDMX. Let's get it. Let's go. Oh, we're starting. Okay, hold on. We're starting with Paul. Let's go, Paulina. Let's do it. We're starting with her. Let's go. And I love the fact that we started with Alejandra over here just rocking out. Let's go. Let me. All right, all right, because remember, remember, this is a concept album, y'all. So no matter how much I want to just sit here and see them rock the hell out, I'm really trying to listen to the lyrics. I was going to have them up, but they don't have the subtitles on this one. So I'm trying to really listen in. If you see why I'm so focused, that's the reason why. Um, But basically, what I think I heard, you know, I have a short memory, y'all, so I lose it quickly. It's why I try to pause, but I didn't want to just pause on her just going in, you know, especially with them going back and forth like that with Alejandra and Paulina going back and forth. I did not want to pause it there. I am confused why Danny's over there like so quiet, though. It, you, every time I'm used to her being like the starter, she, I've never I don't think I've ever seen Paulina start unless it was like showcasing Paulina. So I think that's pretty dope. But as far as the lyrics go, she did say something like, as it builds up, as something builds up, and then it all turns to dust to, yeah, dust to dust. So I'm a little confused on that. I'm about to pull up the lyrics on the other screen, though, y'all, because I really need to understand what's going on in this damn, um, especially in the intro. I have to know what's going on in the intro, y'all. I have to, but they're all rocking the hell out. So this is going to be a little fucking difficult, yo. <laughs> so I'm about to let it play since I took it back and I'm going to get these lyrics up and we're going to knock through. Them. Go. Oh shit, I can't pause it here, y'all. Wait, 
Hey, who is that? I do see that he showed up. I'm trying to remember his name. It's his, I want to say it's Paul, right? His name's Paul. I can look it up. It was either Paul or Dan or Greg. Those are the three names that come to my mind. But I want to say it's Paul. And I remember because I did the Jingle Bell when they, when they were singing like the Jingle Bell Rock. Um, I actually dropped that one on Christmas. And I was not expecting to see their manager pop up. I do know that he's their manager. Last time I seen them, they were all young singing with him. So it's cool to see them all grown up now rocking out with him. I couldn't hear anything he said. Um, but now take it in and behold, I don't see right or wrong. I seek the truth found in death. That's a little creepy to me. Goes hand in hand with remorse. Is it something that's worth losing? worth pursuing but i don't know what they're trying to pursue though that's what i'm confused about like who are they talking to how things can quickly unfold in the end everything just turns back turns back into dust to dust our bones will rust oh okay so they're talking about like from birth to death basically saying that you don't go anywhere after death is that where this is going i'm confused Rudy. Oh, Rudy, Rudy, Rudy. Yes, Rudy. Rudy. I don't know where the fuck I got Paul from. Hey, Elena. That's a great way to do to introduce the album. Yeah. Oh, now Danny's getting into it, huh? Yeah. All right, so. Buenos noches, Mexico! Oh, I think that's the first time I've. What the hell? That's the first time I ever heard Danny's, like, like an accent to Danny. That was the first time I ever heard, heard her with an accent. With the whole Mexico part. That was dope. I love the fact that in the beginning you had Paulina coming in, right? And then it like showcased Alejandra a little bit, but they were going back and forth. Danny was kind of like the outlying one. She was the one kind of just over here doing her own thing. And then it see, I wouldn't say it seemed like it took her a minute to get going, but they just weren't showcasing her. Right. But I think it's incredible how they ended with her. So it like went full circle. And finally, we got some good cutscenes between all three of them. I think that's dope because I'm so sick of, here goes a rant for you. I am so sick of not being able to see all three of them portrayed on stage, but we finally got one that it seemed like that was pretty good. So I'm hoping the whole album is like that. Paulina came in doing her same old movements I talk about, and I think I got it down to a T now, y'all. It's her facial expressions. It's like the way she moves her head when she like goes down the drum sometimes. That's what gets me every time, yo. I don't know what to think of it because sometimes it creeps me out. 
Sometimes I think she's being like silly and having fun. Sometimes I think she looks like that bad little kid when she's doing that. Like she just looks, she reminds me of just like a bad kid at the time. Um, and it's just always different, but it's the same facial expression every time when she leans in to do that. I just think it's dope. But Danny's singing at the end that, uh, like that was dope. I really enjoyed that one.